Andy Boyer with Race Day Live presented by Amsoil. We're here with XPR Motorsports in Jackson Richardson. You're straight off an 11th place finish last weekend. Man, that's a good ride. How are you feeling so far this season? Yeah, no, it was good. I mean, last week was a solid ride. We got some good starts all night in the heat race and in the main. And yeah, to finish with an 11th was good. I mean, the first two rounds didn't go how we wanted it to. But no, it's been good. And we've had a solid week this week. And hopefully we can build on that 11th. Well, you're up against the super teams, you know, and you're here from Australia. You got your van, and this is this is the soul of the sport, you know, and it's really cool to see somebody like you doing it on your own and, and making it happen. I mean, you're out there vying for top tens and looking for more. Yeah, I mean, we got a good group of people that we got helping me out, and X, XPR Motorsports, uh, Chad Braun has just put in a tremendous amount of work over the years, and this year we've really hit it hard. We've... We've got the bike dialed in a lot this year and like as it showed last weekend we, we got great starts and like we've been working a lot with the suspension as well and it's been paying off. Well you got a little bit different dirt here, it's a little more loamy, is that more like of your liking or, or how do you, how's that going to work for you tonight? Yeah, I mean, I love the loamy stuff. I've never been here before, but uh, I've seen a lot of footage and I've studied it a lot and it is a lot softer than the usual West Coast tracks. So yeah, it'll be good. I'm, I'm keen for it. So has your hard work been paying off? Is the phone starting to ring with these good starts and good finishes yet? Uh, not just yet. We've got, we got a lot more to do. Um, I just want to work on being a lot more consistent with my results, not be so up and down. But um, we're working towards it and uh, hopefully that'll happen soon. Well, Jackson Richardson's got his mom, he's got his girlfriend in a Ford van, and he's making it happen. Keep your eye on this guy tonight in Oakland.